Sugar Plums. Robin here with your daily spirit message reading for Tuesday, April 16th. And attempt to shuffle the Starman Tarot deck lengthwise, not going very well. So let me just turn it on its side so I can actually handle it. So I'm getting that song and I think we heard it a little while ago, that song by Crazy Town Butterfly. Um, but I keep on hearing the word butterfly, okay? So you might get a message from a spirit animal butterfly today. And just pay attention to what kind it could possibly be, you know, the color of it, if it's blue or pink or orange, and look that up, okay? Um, it's the thing about spring, summer, and fall is that you get to see a lot more spirit animals. I don't know, it depends on where you are in the world, but we don't have a lot of like animal activity where I live in the winter because it's cold AF. So, whoo, sacred clown coming at you. Okay, so, wow. This is a really, really deep and intense energy. This is the fool in a, like a regular tarot card deck. But in the Starman, the Sacred Clown, there's going to be a mission ahead of you today that looks like it's gonna be just a little bit fraught with danger. I'm gonna write that bad boy down, hold on. So this might be a job for your shadow self to step forward and like really tap into the darker energies that you possess and you know, please don't give me a, oh, who me? You know, it's that person that comes out when you're really angry or, you know, you feel like there's some sort of an injustice or, you know, maybe somebody that you used to be that you think is not there anymore, it, you're still there, okay? So um, you could tap into that. It doesn't mean you have to turn into it. You don't have to be Dr. Jekyll, Mr. or Mrs. Hyde in this case, or Ms. or whatever. Um, you just have to like use that energy, okay? And if you're having a really tough time, um, just picture your favorite, I want to say super villain so that you don't have to handle like dipping into a part of your personality that you worked really hard to sort of forget about or eradicate or integrate, okay? But the good news is with the 10 of cups, whatever is happening over here, you can pull right back out of that energy again, okay? So um, you might even wanna have a, a crystal on you today if you possibly have one you know, like a black obsidian or something like that, or something really refreshing. Like, um, I'm getting a like an image of a pink jade or something like that, or whatever. If you have a good luck talisman, you might wanna grab that before you go out the door today so that you can handle something with ferocity and then just like, oh, nobody saw that. And you can just close the doors back on uh, the darkness that needed to handle that. Like maybe somebody's gonna get in your face today. You just never know, right? Um, and you still have to have that ability to be a warrior in any situation. And we do have the King of Wands here and he looks a little bit to me like Braveheart, okay? So everybody looks at Braveheart, well I do anyway, as this conquering hero. But I mean, there was a lot of stuff going on and you have this, you have the ability to stand up to anybody, anywhere, anytime. I mean, just be careful, obviously, if somebody is like really dangerous, you wanna use your shadow side to get out of there instead of doing anything confrontational, AKA stupid, okay? So safety first, but also remember that you are somebody that came from a long line of warriors, okay? So boom. I'm going to go. Bye. <laughs>